Following a big win last night, the Copperheads were back in action and they have another win. They put together a two-game winning streak as they take down the Dayton Docks today by a final score of 8-1. to one. And Jake, we, we talked about it up in the broadcast booth. Really, great pitching, great hitting. I mean, probably the most complete win we've seen all year. Yeah, Richard Lucas goes six innings, gives up only three hits. The only three hits given up in the game. The bullpen was dominant, too. I mean, Richard Lucas, you can't say enough about his performance and how well he pitched. His only run he gave up was in the first inning. was awesome. Uh, then you had guys like Cody Mizell, Tyler Isbell, and Eric Shanahan come in and shut the door. The offense was fantastic, an all-around win, and the pitching was fantastic. You know, we talked to a couple of the people after this game that were a big part of this victory. We talked to Richard Lucas, and we also talked to Blaze Salter. He had a big time two-run home run in this game. Then we talked to the head man, and they all expressed a lot of excitement about how good the team played as a whole. Everything kind of uh, went together. We, I mean, we had a couple errors, but still good defense behind me, good offense, you know, and uh, Chris behind the plate really calling a good game, you know. Yeah, I feel like, you know, uh, today is, you know, a game that just shows, like, what we can be, you know. I feel like it's a game where it shows like how good we can be and uh, you know if we just clean up the little things if we can be a very very good team this league. It was it was as close as, as we've been all year to uh, you know to, to playing to our potential uh, like, like you said it's a complete game so uh, Richard did a f an unbelievably good job of you know bouncing back from a, from a poor outing his last time out uh, it was was just just as good as you could possibly hope today um, the offense yeah, again you saw you saw them making adjustments yesterday uh, against Lexington especially in that second game squaring some balls up and we continue that today against what I thought was a little bit better pitching than we saw last night. Um, uh, you know, just just the arm wise, you know, we, we were facing some pretty good guys, and, and uh, you know, to see our guys battle and, and put together some good at bats was certainly, uh, you know, certainly a positive sign. So hopefully we can continue this, uh, continue this role because that, that, that's that's a really good win for us. So with the win, the Copperheads go to six and five on the regular season. They are finally back above 500. It's a great place to be, but now they'll be on the road as they go to Hamilton for the second time this year on Tuesday. First pitch of that game will be at 7 o'clock. You can listen to the broadcast on CopperheadBaseball.com as always. And then please make sure you check into all of our media, the Facebook page, the Twitter page, and also, most importantly, our YouTube page. But with that being said, he's Jacob Corrigan. I'm Ryan Boyd, and this has been a Copperheads Recap.